trouble yourself not with the cost of this crusade. Its noble end affords you broad tolerance in your choice of means. Interesting quote there, the cost of this crusade. Um, I have been less concerned with the cost of late, although I don't think that's the kind of cost he's talking about. Because we do finally have enough gold, at least so far. Let me see if there's anything we need to upgrade before we leave. I am so sorry I failed to introduce myself. Welcome back to Darkest Dungeon. I am Tapcat, and we are getting ready to go out on a dungeon run. This is going to be kind of an interesting group. Um, it's definitely more varied as far as our levels. You can see Reynaud is level 5, Jordan's level 4, Alexander 2, Caden is 3. So literally one each of 2 through 5. Well, the uh, I actually took the lowest level guys that I could for the classes that I wanted. Um, the problem is... Normally, I try to avoid bringing level 5s along on dungeons that are veteran level. Didn't really have a choice. Oh, hang on a second. Um, yeah, I could do that. I'd rather wait. Actually, you know what? I'm an idiot. Hold on. We got enough portraits in our last run. I can do that. They fall, but their knowledge lives on. Done. Okay, he's still stuck. So, all right, that's fine. You got to be level five to get the level five skills. Uh, so, what I was going to say is, I was actually going to bring a level four bounty hunter in that slot. And I realized that I didn't have any stress healing as a result. So, I only have two Crusaders and they're both level five. And I'm bringing a level two guy, so he's sure to take extra stress in this dungeon. So I'm kind of stuck. Uh, I want to do a long dungeon in the ruins. And um, if I'm going to do that, I need a stress healer. I also have equipped this book that, you know, reduces his stress damage by 20. And that will hopefully help in addition to the blasphemous vial. Uh, I've given her the kind of what I'm used to now, the Junia's head for extra healing, and then the Ancestor's map, and he is kind of all about damage here, so he's getting a total of 40% damage buffs and plus two speed. Uh, he is the opposite of that when it comes to speed, but I did give him a damage buff and then a healing buff. Uh, he'll get more healing, rather. And I think that's it. We are ready to go. I'm going to bring all the food. And I'm going to bring a stack of shovels. I got to be honest, though. We don't go through a lot of shovels in the ruins. I'll bring three. I think it's a waste of money. I will bring five keys. I definitely want some holy water. Is five? I think I'll bring six. Because I'm crazy like that. You know, I never use laudanum. But it would help against those guys that, uh, you know, put the terror or whatever it's called. Horror terror that, that does stress damage over time. Uh, but I'm going to leave it alone. All right. I think we're ready. Yeah. Just checking. Well, hopefully we can keep Alexander out of trouble and uh, not get him too stressed out. The fiends must be driven back. And what better place to begin than the seat mm. of our noble line? Should have checked that before I left. That was the one upgrade I did not do, but that's all right. He has that. I didn't buy him in courage. Yeah, I, I forgot about the um, survivalist tent. So that was a bit of a miss. Well, 
you know what whatever let's just move on so we'll come down here since this whole little pathway well that's a nice way to start ancient traps lie in wait unsprung and thirsting for blood I was gonna say this pathway is kind of a dungeon unto itself in a way I'll just get rid of that. She's not hurt too badly. Well, I'm going to get a chance to use my first shovel. Watch. Because we came to the ruins last time. This time, I, I could just imagine there'll be like 10,000... Um, <laughs> you know, 10,000 stupid... Uh, God... I get so distracted when I'm talking sometimes. Obstacles. God, that isn't really that hard to say, is it? The wounds of war can be healed, but never hidden. Yep, here we go. The madness starts. Love that stress damage. Alright, that's another one down. From our lands. Come on, man. Let's take these idiots out. Back to the pit. Yep. Is that enough? No, it's one short. Classic. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Alright. Let's go Victory use that shovel. Victory. But a victory nonetheless. The alchemy table. I need herbs. Do I have herbs? I do not. Well, I may do it on the way back for torchlight. We'll see. Boy, I need to take that idiot out. Nice! That's outstanding. Let's slow his roll. I'm not necessarily looking forward to having two of these guys to deal with, but I think we'll be all right. We will give it the old college try, if nothing else. Yeah, baby. Okay. Well. Confidence surges wow. All right. He's a little, little bit easier than I expected. I'm sure. So how am I going to kill this idiot? He's definitely going to get a shot off. But this will be the only attack he gets. He's going to die on his next turn. So. I see Alexander started early with the stress. So we definitely want to try to get on top of that. Um, let me do this. Just to get that stupid thing out of the way. I don't quite want to kill him yet. I'm hoping I get a chance. I guess I won't. I'd want to get a chance to do one more stress heal. Okay. Beautiful. And I know that um, my Vestal has more stress on her. But he's the one I'm more worried about. Alright. That's that. He's over. Nice. She got a stress heal off of that. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. Alright, I was hoping if I played for time, I could get one more stress heal. Didn't happen. Oh well. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Well... I mean, 
think I already have one of those. I'm going to get rid of the torch. And what I'll do is, if I can just get in a fight, then I'll go ahead and um, use the food to heal. Only the first test. Now it must be carried home. I just dumped Jade. It's not worth a ton. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing. I knew this would happen. I shorted myself on shovels, so now they're gonna make me pay. Another one falls. Good. Um, I'll just go for the stun. He's not really gonna get a kill. Oh, it resisted anyway. Oh, I should have paid attention. Their stun chance is really, really good. Stun resistance, I should say. So, it's a little bit of a waste even trying it on now, I suppose. Uh, what does the AUG do? I guess I'll worry about it another time. A faint hope blossoms. Mm-hmm. Alright. Give them no quarter. Yeah, she's the only one that is really still dealing with stress. Oh, is anybody hurt? No. <laughs> Not in the slightest, actually. So I'm definitely gonna loot all the curios in this area. I don't want to backtrack into this area. I don't care if we do it like down here somewhere because that's relatively compact. But I don't think I want to be coming like down here and then come all the way back down. That's a little crazy. Do I just want to stun her? I feel like that's the safer way to go. See, and it's funny because you watch that and you go, oh, you look, you didn't even need to stun. Well, honestly, I might have, though. Because if I hadn't stunned her, then she could have taken her stress attack before we killed her. You know, we don't know where she would have gone in that order. And they're pretty quick, usually, so it is very possible that she would have gotten an attack, so... I don't feel bad about it at all. Like, I'm glad I did that. Alright, well that was... Ooh, Ruby. Okay. Um, there you go. Eat up. I'm going to take the Ruby. I would like more bus. You know, I think what I'm going to do... I'm going to get rid of the crest. But I'm probably going to have to get rid of that leper trinket. I just think in the end it's not really going to be that useful. Okay. Well, I got lucky. I, w I wanted to use herbs there. Oh, I don't have herbs. Never mind. I could use more portraits. But I don't think I'm going to start a stack for one. All right, this will be the end of this area. Maybe I should camp when I get all the way up here. Although, I, it's not that I need to. It would strictly be more about clearing out space. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to play grenade and that'll be the end of the Bone Noble. And then let's do that all right good deal beautiful although that makes his point blank shot a little bit less good and by a little bit I mean a ton I don't think I need a stress heal no so we just bring the pain beautiful is the weapon that cuts every time literally every time I bring a highwayman you know and I get repost up 
Oh, it just makes me so happy. It's so good. Alright, there you go. End of fight. This expedition at least promises success. <sighs> An emerald. Alright, I'm losing the healing amulet, I think. I've got the one, you know, on him that does 40% bonus healing on anybody. And that's obviously really, really good. I'm gonna lose this. Huh. I'm gonna take that. Does anybody need heals? He does. And that's it. As far as gold goes, I mean, I could get rid of, you know, this, but I don't want to. Let's just give that stuff up. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to walk back up here and we're going to camp. And that'll clean out a little bit of room. And this may sound weird, but if I'm going to hit a food tile soon, then hopefully I will, like before I camp, because that'll just get rid of another stack. If I, well, if I even use eight food, I'll be honest, I don't know if I need to. If I keep taking stress damage, I may need to though. Oh, come on. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and do this, I guess. This will uh, give us the torch back up to 100. A blazing star is born. So, for the cost of just one torch, you know, that's pretty decent. So, that's why I purposely let it get low. Now, I could go one more room instead of... There we go. Uh, instead of camping where I was going to... I don't know if there's going to be curios and stuff. That's my only issue. Or fights. You know, stuff that's going to make me... Alright, this I don't mind. I think what I'm going to do... Uh, okay. I'm going to leave that backpack. We're going to come back for it in just a second. This is perfect. I'm going to camp after this fight. Ooh. Play a grenade. Now, let's try to stun him. I don't mind if these two swing at him, although one isn't. But this guy can hit pretty hard. And he also is very likely to attack somebody else. Obliterated. Oh. Yep. All right. Well, he's not going to be quite as tough now. And he's going to be really easy to kill. Beautiful. Oh. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. A full frickin' stack of gold. Alright, I'm gonna lose the three deeds. I'm greedy for gold. That's probably stupid, but... Whatever. What does this do? 20% stun resist. 20% stun resist. I mean, what am I gonna drop? I don't know if I need torches, if I'm honest. I may not need as many as I'm carrying. If I keep using the stress heal and her uh, other thing, I could just dump a stack of torches. You know what? I'm going to do it. Huh. Stun resist. I'm never going to use it, but I don't care. I'll throw it away and take something else. A moment of respite. A chance to steel oneself against the coming horrors. 
I probably also did not necessarily need to use eight food there, but I wanted to to get rid of another stack. So I'm going to do this. And I'm going to clean guns. And then... Does he have anything? Eh, not really. Um... Okay, 10 accuracy and 10 dodge. Let's... Do I want to put it on you? Yeah, you know, because... He's probably more vulnerable, or she's probably more vulnerable. Alright, I'm good with this. Um... You don't have a disease, but it does give 20% disease resist? Sure, why not? I just realized I, I hit rest instead of using it. I meant to use it. The light, the promise of safety. Okay. Um, actually, let's do this. Just use it. Cool. He's got a lot of buffs right now. You know what? I'm okay. I'm okay with that. Okay. Wow. We have some stuff to go to. Let's come down here because I want to. Might as well just do this stupid obstacle. Although maybe I should avoid that obstacle. Part of me wants to get the item out of my inventory. Part of me thinks, well, then again, you can avoid that one potentially. What about the one you can't avoid? Oh, whatever. It's time to get in a fight. Quit your whining and get to fighting. Hmm. Think I want to slow them down just a little tiny bit. And... I'm glad I did it, because... They're definitely ready to go. Okay. Well... That's unfortunate. Because, well, Alexander can hit her. <sighs> Wicked, man. Wicked. Is it unholy? It sure is. Oh. Man, why you gotta do that? Uh-oh. Well, that's what I was trying to avoid. And of course they hit Alexander. The most vulnerable. You're dead. Okay. Well, I'll help him, her, to the extent I can. Doesn't matter. She's still dead. <laughs> Uh, does anybody need a heal? Sure. Yeehaw! There we go. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. I would like the onyx. I think I'm going to let it go. And I'm going to see if I can get him a buff. It's not guaranteed. You have like a 75% chance. Ruins Adventurer. That's pretty cool, actually. Um, I wouldn't lock it in, you know. But because Crusaders are really good in the Ruins to begin with. But they're on Holy Bonus. It's just, you know, another thing that makes them good there. I'm going to let the crest go. Oh, boy. Okay. Well. Let's see. This, I'm pretty sure. Hang on. Minus 20%. Yeah. Let's just do this. Oh. Oh, that's not good. 
That's really not good. Ah, uh, let's try this. Okay. Now. Oh my gosh. Wow, this guy. I mean, he has 29 dodge, but still. I mean, I don't know what I'm going to do when we miss like that. We could have killed him. Like, absolutely could have killed him. Just did not get it done, you know? Oh, come on. Wow. Come on, like, please, let me do something here. This is crazy. I'm going to end up having to <laughs> use Duelist Advance just to get Riposte up. Or at least they stunned him again, but somebody hurt him. Oh my god, come on. That is nuts. Wow. Ugh. I have a 71% ch chance to hit this idiot. Finally. Okay. Uh, let's do play grenade back here. I'm just in awe. Like, we just kept missing. Four in a row. It's so weird to just watch them whiff and whiff. To a killing blow. Hate using this. Actually, you know what? I'm going to do this. I need to move the stupid noble up. Because we're in trouble here. Um, I'm going to try to stun him as well. Because we're taking quite a bit of stress. Okay. Um... Yeah, this is perfect. Now, that's just lethal damage. He's gonna, yeah, he's done. So, let's get rid of this idiot. And I'm kind of hoping my Vestal goes next. Or nobody. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? So what I wanted to do is have her do a group heal. What am I going to do with the three deeds? I'm going to get rid of that and I'm going to take the three deeds. I think I threw away three deeds earlier and, you know, I wish I had them now. I'd have a full stack, but whatever. All right. No more shovel. I can only hope there's no more obstacles. There may not be, to be fair. Okay. Um, I think what I'm going to do, rather than do a bunch of backtracking, let me see. This is a damage buff. Let me do this. Yep. Okay. It's pretty good. I'm going to do that. A handsome reward for a task well performed. Hmm, good. Okay, we're just going to go all damage here. A singular strike. Not bad. So I'm not going to use him on her. Because she's easy pickings for Alexander. All I gotta do is throw a play grenade and she's dead. So this idiot, 40% protection. I have a 70% chance. Oh no, 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 never mind. Forget I said anything. Let's do this. And then we'll just unload on him. I'm gonna have her do a group heal, but everybody else gonna hit him for all we're worth it's a shame
shame he didn't do that to him, but whatever. Prodigious size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. Well, um, yeah, I mean, okay. Surprise! Hmm. Does it matter which one I hit? I'm more likely to kill him. Could have gotten her too if I was going to do that much damage. Alright. I'm going to stun her. I think I'll use my Vestal to just damage her as much as I can. Or not. I'm a lot less happy with that attack now. Oh well, it is what it is. You can't control who's going to hit and who's going to miss. You can always miss. Always. There's always at least a 10% chance. That is slightly awkward. Um, yeah, man, is it? So what's this guy? Yeah, he's got way too much health for that to really be meaningful. Uh, I didn't need that. Okay, I need to do this. Man, I need her gone and I'm stuck. And I really, really need to do a stress heal here. But I gotta kill her before I like, she'll just hit again for more stress than I've healed. So, it, yeah, okay, let me do this. That'll be the end of him. So now, I can just focus on her. All right, I guess I don't get to do a stress heal after all. Although, I might be able to. We'll see in a second. If my Crusader gets another turn. All right, at least I can do that. I don't need him getting afflicted. As victories mount, so too will resistance. All right, I think I'm going to let the bus go. I've already got two full stacks, which is pretty darn good. I mean, let's be honest. Um, I just, you know, I can only carry so much stuff out of here. So, let's leave it at that. Now, the sarcophagus I want to leave alone. I'm actually getting tempted to camp again. Just for the sake. Um, man, you only have a 60% chance. 80. Let's do, uh, let's do him. Wonderful. Carelessness All right. Find no clemency in this place. All right. Well, I gotta say that that wasn't great. All right. All right. So we got this little thing to do, and then we can go down. And I've been cleaning everything out, so there's no backtracking we'll have to do at all. Which I'm actually quite happy about. I'm going to try again. Got back almost half of what that cost me last time. Hard to say that's a good trade. And I'm out of room again. Um, like every curio in here uses holy water. Keys. Yeah, I'm just going to have to live with it. But that's why I'm ready to camp, I think. I'll get rid of another stack of food, which is good. All right, we're done here. So I think I'll come back down to this room and then um, camp before I'm in a position to loot again. And maybe what I'll do too is once I get down there, oh brother, I got another fight. Uh, maybe I'll go ahead and stop looting 
the stuff like, uh, oh man. Hmm. I may not be able to do the big camp now. The one where I use eight food and get stress relief. I think I'm going to have to forego that. That would only leave me four food left. So, you know, one food tile is all I could afford. That's kind of scary. It's so easy to just hit a couple in a row. Happens all the time. He's done. Now, we don't really need heals, so let's just bring the beats. Yeah, that's right. How'd you like that trade, jackass? Compassion is a rare Gotta do what I can for Alexander as we go along here, though. I feel like we can keep him up, keep her okay. Alright, it's done as well. Uh, I think you're the only one that needs any healing whatsoever. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. I probably should have taken the crests there, to be fair. I'm gonna do four. In tenuous firelight. An uneasy companionship. <sighs> Reduce stress by 15 for everybody. I'm going to do that. I'm going to encourage him. Let's prevent the ambush. And then that's it. I can't, uh, I can't cure any more stress. Alright. There we go. I actually did it that time. Okay. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted and purpose is made clear. Man, oh man, we have got some loot. All right, let's come down here. I'm curious to see, like, do I even need all these holy waters? I know I'm not going to need six, just to be clear. I don't want to do that, man. <gasps> oh, my. Curious is the trap maker. As you might imagine, that was an accident. Unwitnessed by his own eyes. I, I literally just brain cramped for a second because obviously I selected him to disarm the trap. And then, for no reason, instead of clicking on that spot to have him disarm, my finger hit the arrow button to move him to the side. So we just walked right into the trap. So I got that going for me. Soothed. Yeah. Sedated. I'm actually going to do this. Uh, hitting this guy for a little bit of damage, not really that exciting. And at least we're getting Alexander down to a stress level now that's kind of manageable. I mean, when I think he was at 70 a little while ago. And that's scary close. Especially because you've seen, like, you can get between 20 and 30 in one shot from these guys. It's crazy how quick they can pile it up on you. Uh, I would have liked to have had a chance to heal him. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. This should be interesting. Okay. I got a full stack of deeds. I think I'm going to leave it at that. I'm going to lose this, though. I say I'm going to leave it at that. I tell you what. I'm going to grab the crests. It's very, very likely that I can get more crests and fill that stack by the end of this dungeon. 
I used a bunch when we upgraded, I think it was the guild. It was either the guild or the blacksmith. And, uh, yeah, I should have left this one. I tell you what. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. There you go. First things first. That was beautiful. Second. Do this. Third. Please do that. I wish it was a better one, but... Okay, so I think what I'm going to do... Is stun here. Because I need to know that he's not going to get hit twice, if nothing else. Okay. Even though I have repost up, I'm kind of glad he didn't get attacked. Woo! 56. You know what? I want every little bit of healing. Perfect. Perfect. Literally perfect. Alright, he's out of danger now. I mean, to the extent you can say that about anybody in Darkest Dungeon. <laughs> Ghoulish horrors. Brought low and driven into the mud. Okay. We are getting down to it now, man. Two rooms left. Good, now I got some scouting. Okay, I'm going to avoid the obstacle. We'll go this way. If we're lucky, maybe we pick up a shovel. I don't have... I don't have herbs. And I don't have a torch. So the alchemy table is going to do nothing. Oh good, he gets to go first and stress Alexander. I was hoping that would happen. I was so afraid this guy was going to get a crit and like spike another 20 or more on there. Okay. Yeah, you need to be dead. So that's a thing. And you need to be healed. And that's another thing. Yep. That didn't work out too well for you, did it, buddy? Let's start working on that. It also is going to give me some torchlight. That's one of the reasons I was okay dumping the torches. I feel like if I get some stuns and some stress heals, uh, we're going to be okay. So, yeah, I'm going to do Plague Grenade. Start him on a countdown. That was actually really good that I got Stress Heal off of that. Okay, you know, he got kind of beat up again. Sedated. All right. Now I feel okay. Let's go ahead and just do this. And pull this moron forward. I'm almost tempted to just let him take one more. Oh, no, no. <laughs> I'm going to work my torch. Wow. I could have gotten so, so many busts out of this place. It's crazy. But... Um, I'm kind of stuck here. Like, I can't really afford to throw anything else away. And I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it. Okay. Um, this is another combat buff, right? Yeah. So, let's give it to him. And the Lord knows I got enough of this holy water. Oh, 
Okay. Um, I feel like this is the way to go here. Although part of me wants to do this. But we're not going to kill both of these guys this turn. It's just super, super unlikely. Okay, but if I have a chance, it's her killing this guy. Mm. Well, let's settle that. Yep, yeah, I'm officially in trouble. Thanks for asking. Okay. Um, the problem is the guy I killed is the one I care about least in this whole group. I have to do this. There's really no... So, I mean, he can go after them next turn. Oh, man, he almost did it. Well, Plague Grenade. Plague Grenade is all I need. They're both badly hurt, so they're done as soon as he gets to go. All right. I definitely want to heal here. Man, he has really been getting trashed. Okay, we're right. we're doing okay though. Fifth key, ooh, a third ruby is nice. So here again, now I could dump the holy water. We have one curio left. You know what? I will do that. Trinkets and baubles, paid for in blood. It looks like, unless I pull a shovel out of that curio, <laughs> it looks like I'm stuck when it comes to digging through that obstacle. That's not great for me, but... Alright, backpack, what do you say? laden with loot are often low on supplies it says piss off that's what it says a treasure that that probably means there's a chest so I need my key well look I think obsessing over 1200 I could get rid of my food you know what I'm gonna. I think we're close enough. Here, let me do this. Where are you at? Here, give it to him. All right. Done. Now we're about to take damage, which kind of sucks, <laughs> but With not a lot. Iron, you must rely on it's the stress that bothers me. Oh God. Ah, look at that. Look at how quickly that changed. This is why you do not want to run out of food. I mean, seriously, do not want to run out. That was good. That was very good. Play a grenade. Finish him. Impressive. Yep, he's dead. Now, I'm going to go for a stun here. Because I want light in part. At least a little. Help. Oh, man. You are doing work, buddy. We only need to walk a tile or two. Okay, I have to do this. Who's got it worst? Actually, him. I'd like to get two stress heals in. One on him, one on her. So, I can't stun this guy. Um, that's fine. I'll just give him a noxious blast. A blast from the past. And he's got the stun resist, so I can't really do much there. Let's just do a group heal. 
compassion is a rarity. I do wish I could stun him this turn, though. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna do that. I want another stress heal. I'm not kidding. So I'm taking a chance that this guy won't crit. Alright, well, I didn't get to do it. <laughs> One thing that kind of sucks... Because I'm not sure I'm filling this out. And then there were three bus in the other one. So that was like another option, you know. <sighs> but that's all right. I'm just going to live with it. Whatever happens, happens. We either get another six crests out of this chest or we don't. I'll tell you what sucks, though. I'm pretty sure that chest does not need a key. Uh, that said, I'll probably throw away the key to take whatever's there anyway. Because there's basically almost nothing that I can pick up without doing that. Like, pretty much six crests. And... I could pick up these gems. That's it. So, I mean, if that's what that chest has, then so be it. I'm really still not exactly going to call that a loss, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah, I guess I don't even really want light now. Uh, unfortunately, I do need to use him for stress heals if I can, because we're going to pay really good money to, to cure all this when we get back home. Yeah, uh, I got to take care of her. Wow, she's up there. Please don't target her. Please, uh, of course, of course. A dizzying blow to body and Welcome brain. to being afflicted. Well, we'll see. We'll see. Maybe. Well, she's paranoid. <sighs> now, I will say, I was worried about keeping her stress down because she's level two. It played a part, but not a big part. It really didn't. The big issue was the stress we took when we had to dig through that obstacle. And it was literally the one shovel that I took out of my inventory when I was buying provisions that caused that. Yeah, screw it. I just need to kill this guy. Um, and then getting hit, you know, right at the end there classic to give me a shovel now that is so darkest dungeon i appreciate the trolling okay so if i remember correctly this you just open there's not going to be a lock so i'm just going to do that yep contents unknown well i got an emerald and another hundred gold and I'm not throwing away anything in my inventory for stupid citrine. But overall, I worked out pretty well. I'll get them stress treatment. To rest. Devils remanded to their abyss. I mean, we got well over 30,000 gold. So spending a few thousand on stress treatment, you know, not the end of the world. We also, by the way, got the focus ring, which is pretty nice. It does kind of screw your dodge chance. But as you go into the later dungeons, their accuracy gets so much better. Your chances at dodging are pretty much non-existent anyway. Um, I'm overstating it a little bit, but it's poor. So that big of an accuracy boost is nice because you also start fighting guys in champion dungeons uh, more and more where like their dodge is quite good. So, anyway, we got a total of 18 deeds out of that, which is really nice. So, Renat is still level 5. I wondered if doing a long one would be enough to push him up. It wasn't, but we did get Alexander up to level 3, which I am happy about. Um, overall, not bad. instrument of butchery mm. and bloodshed cures for the taking okay that's quite good that's quite good because now that we have level five upgrades we can do okay this is less good because i'm pretty sure 
that she has a disease still. Yeah, that's too bad. Okay, let's put her back in. Before I do that, what does this do? Um, I mean, I did all that. I don't have enough bus for that, so let's go ahead. The front line of this war is not in the dungeon, but rather inside the mind. Come on. There we go. And one of the people we brought had a disease. What did she get? Okay, that's pretty terrible. <sighs> Not going to send her back out with that. Okay, so now um, I would like... Oh, man, who did I put in here last time? Maro was one of them. And I think that I'm done with him. I locked in hard skinned. Um, these are all perfectly fine, but I don't care enough to, you know, lock them in. So I can cross Morrow off my list. Uh, now Zoth is actually one of the people who has a positive quirk. I'd like to lock in, but she's not really an option right now. Um, what about Vincent? Because he's on my list. So that's not it. Wait, what's this? Plus 10% healing done while camping. And plus 20% healing done while camping. Thing is, I just don't usually rely on camping to do that much healing. Uh, quick reflexes. That's the one I want. And then is there anything I want to get rid of? Um, 15% stress damage received versus unholy. That's not great, but it's not the end of the world. All right. I think I will get rid of this just in case I bring him where he has to fight unholy. Clumsy isn't great, but like I say, dodge gets less and less reliable as you move on in the game anyway. So it's not necessarily a big thing. And then Sterling is another one. So he's got the same two that my lower level. Um, hang on. Wasn't ZX on the list too? No, he wasn't. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and lock in the plus 10% there. Uh, let's see. In town, we'll never drink. Okay, let's get rid of that. That's kind of crappy, because he's someone I would want to use against human opponents. Okay. All right. Well, we burned through a little bit of gold that way. Now, um, can I upgrade? I know I get a free weapon upgrade anyway. I don't have enough crests. So I do need now to focus on crests a little bit. Fair enough. Uh, but... If I bring one of my level fives in, yep, I do get a freebie. So let me think about that. You know what? I have to do it this week. And a level four, you can't. It has to be a level five. Well, you do a crap ton of damage. Let's give it to you. All right. Fair enough. Uh, let's just get an idea of who we're going to fight next time. So I did unlock the prophet in the ruins. That's why we took that dungeon in the first place. So I think when we come back, what I will do is probably go after the prophet because I would love to get another book of sanity. These are super good. To get this benefit with no downside is really nice. The eight crests and six busts is another nice thing. This trinket, I already have one, and unlike the book, like it's really only good for the Plague Doctor, and I never bring two Plague Doctors on one, you know, dungeon. So I think I'd rather get this reward right now.
So as long as I can put together an appropriate party, I have to think a little bit about who I want to bring. If I remember right, uh, for the profit, the biggest thing is you really want a man at arms. And I'm pretty sure that I have, yeah, Maro is free, Zach is free, and then we can look at building the rest of the party. So I think we're good. So let's plan on doing that when we come back, but that's all for now. Thanks for watching. I hope we see you next time.